Hello, what is up YouTube? Hope y'all are enjoying your summer so far. Um, I know I am. Hope, well, this week has been going by pretty slowly, but, uh, I can always find a way to just have fun on Minecraft. So, uh, I will be bringing you guys a new, t uh, series of tutorials, and for this one, I will be doing famous landmarks, okay? Uh, today in this video, we are going to be making the Eiffel Tower. I just finished making... Uh, a model one so we are going to be just copying off that one kind of and um yeah so first don't expect me to build something like the Statue of Liberty I would never like I can never get that much detail and everything so uh today we're using the default texture pack just to help you guys out with uh what it's gonna look like in the end ah <sighs> wait for it to load okay um when you're just looking at it from this it looks okay but uh at this angle it looks really weird like um if you want to make any changes like just take out the observatories or something that would look about a lot better um but yeah i forgot to measure this out one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen thirteen blocks in between okay guys so let's get started i am building this out of clay um i find that up close it kind of looks weird but from far away it looks pretty good so um you guys can just build it out of whatever you want like stone or i don't know gravel if you're like at the time that you're making this if you're drunk or something go ahead and use bedrock or gravel but uh i'll be using clay again and you're also gonna need you're gonna need clay, uh, windows, and stone slabs. Um, let's turn down the render distance because I know it's kind of laggy. Okay, guys. So first, you want to start off with three, four, five. So make it make a five by five square. Okay. And then on top of that, make a 4x4. Four four. Okay, guys, so if this is going to be the outside of the tower, and that's pointing in towards it, you want there to be just one block layer here. So now we're going to count out to the next quarter. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, Bam, one, two, three, four, so, yeah, we need another five by five. And another four by four on top. Okay, so you guys get what I'm talking about, so you need five by five, four by four, and in the middle, It'll just be, it'll, like, from when you're looking on the inside, it'll just pretty much look like this, okay? And in between each is 13 blocks, and that's in between, okay? So I'll get back to you once I'm done the other two posts of the end, okay? Let's see. Alright, guys, I am back, and it's getting kind of dark, so uh, hopefully you guys will be able, still be able to see. I've noticed that whenever I'm recording, um, my brightness somehow... So for some reason turns down so anyways now on each of these you're going to place another 4x4 four four block so that should be one hangover and once again just make sure that there's that one block layer there and we're actually going to be building this 4x4 four four block too high so technically yeah it's going to be a 2x4 a four by four by two okay so that's what it looks like do it on the other one two okay two. and then build it up by two so yeah I'll be back once again once I'm finished putting on the two by four 
Okay, four by four by two blocks on these two pillars. Okay, see so ya. Yeah. Okay, YouTube, I am back from making those two pil the two pillars, and that pig really wants on top of one, but we cannot let pigs inside our build. Anyways, so we're going to repeat that process by building another 4x4 four four block on top. Once again, it's going to be too high, and once again, you want it to have another one block layer here. So, just like this. Another four by four. And another four by four here. And four by four layer on top of that one. And YouTube, once again, I'll be back once I'm finished uh, updating those two pillars. So, see you in a bit. Okay, YouTube, I am back from updating these two pillars. Um, and now, we're going to stop building those stupid old 4x4s. And we're going to update this to make it a 6x6. Six six. So on each block, there's going to be a 3 block hang over there. Hang up. Hang there. And also you want it to have that one block hangover hangout thing again. Okay. So updating this second little pillar. So you guys want a three block in between space here. So everything equals to three pretty much. Okay. So yeah, you want a three block thing there. And now once you're done putting each of these on, each of these six by six pieces on, there should just be a simple cross in the middle. Uh, three blocks wide. Okay. So I'll be back once I'm done updating these two and talk to you in a bit. All right, guys. So now we have the three block cross in the middle. So just to cover that off, we are going to build a, not really sure on the dimensions of this, but you just want to build a two block high wall kind of thing, intersecting, connecting each of those four stands. So yeah, I say once again, a two block high connecting all four things okay so connect that fill it in and then build another layer fill it in okay so I'll be back once we're done that all right guys I'm back from putting on that big two block layer um, uh, now once again kind of put another little square of clay, stone, whatever you're using around the outside layer. Except you wanna leave out well except you wanna leave a one block layer around the sides. So I'll be back once I'm done that. See ya. Okay guys, so we are going to be putting on our first observatory on this build, okay? So first you wanna just build a ring of glass all around this, all around this block here. I'm going a bit slow here. Okay, and for the second layer, um, like the second glass block here, build it around the outside of this, okay? So, I'm not going to do this side, I'm just gonna do half the builds and all that. Um, yeah, so, now just copy that and do it on the other corners, and then you're going to end up with a, just a big box of the glass, okay? So I'll be back really soon once I'm done that. As I am back, and we are about, eh, I say 50, percent away from being finished um next you want to just put on 
a layer of clay all along this. So that's going to be the roofing slash ceiling for this one absorbatory. So you can just go ahead and fill in the entire ceiling. And you remember that you want it to also be over the glass too. So I'll be back once I'm done filling in this entire ceiling with the clay slash stone. Well, we are back from filling in that roof, and now we're going to be introducing the second half of this build. And what? Okay, there we go. Now, guys, I'm just gonna check actually. Three by three blocks. Yeah. Okay. Um. Two, five. Okay. Sorry, I didn't do much preparation for this build, but that's okay. We can just. We can just play it cool. Um, so now what you want to do is at every corner, once again with that one block edge around the edge, side, whatever, build a three by three block, just one. So there should be a big cross in the middle, a nice and thick cro cro cross. No, that's bad. <laughs> Anyways, um, once you're done building in those three, put in, um, another 3x3 three three block, once again with that little edge around the side, and once you're done that, you want to build up these ones an extra four blocks. So in total here, there should be five blocks going up. And then, so you want to have it. One second. You want it to be looking like that, okay? So do that on all three of these other unupdated stilts and I'll get back to you once as soon as I'm done that. And guys, I am back from filling in those blocks. Next, we're going to be putting in a two block high another kind of ceiling and this is where our second observatory is going to go. You want it to have the one block edge around the side and you want to be connecting all four stilts like the other one so now once I'm done that I'll get back to you guys so yeah uh, see you in a bit okay guys I am back from filling in that one block now we are going to repeat that process of the glass observatory down there by filling in filling in the entire box with a layer of glass on the first block and then we are going to be putting a one block higher one block out layer of glass too so once I'm done this and once you're done that I'll be getting back to you guys so I'll see you in a bit okay guys I'm back from filling that in and this is where you need your stone slab um, you're going to be building the entire roof um, actually no you're not. You're just going to be putting a two block, well I guess just a full block of half slabs around it, just just around it, okay? And then you're going to be filling in the place where you can actually stand with your clay slash stone. Okay, so I'll be back once I'm done that. Okay guys, this is what you want it to look like once you're done that, see? So there's going to be the half slabs on the outside and your stone slash clay in the middle. Um, now what you're going to want to do is take your clay and build four 2x2 two two blocks. Like everything else, you want that one block edge of clay um, in the middle you also want to put in a one block just like that 
and we're going to be actually building these five blocks high. So each of these will be five blocks high. Three, four, five. So yep, put up every single one of these, including the middle, five blocks high. So I'll see you when you're done that. Okay guys, so once you're done putting all those five blocks high, you want to just fill in the top so that from bird eye view, you cannot see anything except just a six by six, five by five block, yeah. Okay, so now next you want to build kind of like an X, okay? And then you're going to want to build it up 19 blocks, I think it was. 19, um, yeah, build it up 19 blocks and I'll actually just check and make sure uh, right now that it is 19 so I'll be back once all of these are 19 high maybe so I'll uh, see you in a bit okay guys I am back and make it actually 16 blocks high so just take off three blocks from the top and once again you want to just fill that in so it, from bird's eye view you just see a three by three block anyways I also forgot to do one thing with you guys is that build a three block high there and what you want to do is actually fill that in so three block and fill the top in just with one layer of half slabs okay so that's what it's going to look like actually i think i missed up there okay so actually take a block off here block in there block off 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 Okay guys, so let's see what do I have to make up mistakes. Yeah, so just now what you want to do is just go around each one of these, just film in like that, so make kind of like an L. And then now what you want to do is build the doorway kind of thing like that on each of these little indents in the wall. So I'll be back once I'm done that. Okay, YouTube, I am back, and now we are nearing the end of this tutorial. And for this last observatory, do not make that ring around it. You want to build a two block high square around the outside edge. So there's going to be really nothing under that glass. And then also, when you're done that first layer, just build a second layer. So you can actually stand in that observatory. And then what I want you guys to do is fill in that entire thing with half slabs. Including the ceiling, but I actually want you guys to place two half slabs on each square block like that. Now, place a 3x3 three three clay slash stone block. And now build up six blocks. One, two, three. One, two, three. Wait. Did I put a third on? Okay, one, two, three. One. No, I did not. Okay, my bad. Six blocks and one black block at the top. Okay, guys. So get both Eiffel Towers in this picture. This has been my Eiffel Tower tutorial. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, my next story will probably be on the Big Ben or Stonehenge. Uh, if you guys have any other suggestions, please message me. Um, as you see in my channel profile picture, I have the uh, Lincoln Memorial. I will be making that because I love, love, love to do famous landmarks as in politics and all that. I, on my other Fortress Craft World on the Xbox, I had so many, so many U.S. government kind of landmarks and stuff. So, um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this tutorial. I know it's not the best Eiffel Tower, yet it's also not the worst. And I've also noticed that there's not many tutorials up there for Eiffel Towers. Any, not any complete, really, actually. But, uh, so, yeah. Um, anyways, uh, kind of comment if you like, like if you like subscribe to me this is the kind of stuff you'll see if you subscribe anyways thanks for tuning in uh like comment rate subscribe thanks for watching
Bye.